Dear students, today, we will discuss about the inverse of a composite function. Let, we have, two functions, f of x, and g of x, as they are given to us. In start, we will find out the composite function, and, after that we will find its inverse. The composite function is written as, f, not, g, which is known as f, of, g of x, to find f, of, g of x. We will just put g of x in place of, x, in f function. Now, putting the value of, g of x, which is x divided by 2 plus 4. Then, by simplification we get the composite function, f, of, g, which is x plus 7. Now, we will find the inverse of this composite function, as, we have, calculated f, of g, which is x plus 7. As in general, we use, y, in place of f of x, or g of x, or f of, g of x etc. Therefore we have y is equal to x plus 7. Solving this equation for x, we have x is equal to y minus 7. Dear students, here note an important point. As in general, f of x is equal to y, then applying f inverse on both sides, we have x as an inverse function of y. Therefore, replacing x by f inverse of y in equation 1. We have now replacing variable y by x, we get which is inverse of the composite function. Dear students, there is nothing different in finding inverse of a function or to find the inverse of a composite function. I hope there was nothing difficult in today's lecture. Thank you.